you are looking for a camera that could shoot high quality content across all platforms, vertically. Well, after trying many different camera brands, trying many different types of cameras, I've come to the conclusion that the Sony a7 III is gonna be that camera. Let me tell you why. The Sony a7 III is going to give you 4K 24 and 30 FPS. That's how you're gonna get that super high quality Instagram reel, TikTok, YouTube short, or whatever that you occasionally come across on your feed. It looks like it's definitely not shot on a phone or something similar. You also get that 1080, 120, and 60 FPS. So you get to play around with a bunch of slow-mo if you really want to. And on top of all of that, this camera has fantastic low light capabilities, meaning that it's reliable in pretty much every situation. So now you know the camera, great, but that's only for the quality of the video itself. If you really wanna optimize your camera for vertical video, you wanna make sure that you have a wide lens. The range I would suggest is between 16 millimeters to 35 millimeters. And the reason for that is because if you don't have that wide look, that vertical frame is gonna be super tight for you, making it very difficult to fit whatever shots that you're trying to do in camera. For reference, for all my vertical videos, the lens I like to pair with my Sony a7 III is the Tamron 17 to 28 millimeter f2.8 lens. I actually made an in-depth video about that lens, so I'll leave that for you right up here, check it out. By the way, a helpful tip, when you get a tripod for this setup, it doesn't matter what tripod, you just wanna make sure that it has a fluid head. And you want that because it's gonna allow you to put your camera in any angled position, including, of course, vertical. I personally use a Joelkin travel tripod, sturdy, fluid head, looks cool. Fantastic. Now there are two quality of life functions the Sony a7 III has that just makes shooting vertical content a lot easier. The first one is gonna be the in-camera balancer. So you have that balancer, you would think it's normally for horizontal, but if you turn the camera vertically, that balancer is gonna come to that vertical standpoint too, which is fantastic. And two, the Sony a7 III shoots in an H.264 codec. So although you have these super high quality 4K video files that can be relatively heavy, as long as you have a good condition MacBook or a decently powerful PC, your editing process should be very smooth. Keep in mind, while I have been preaching about this camera for vertical content, it is an all around great camera for any use case. It could be for photography, it could be for cinematics, it could even be for your YouTube channel, vlogging, and all that good stuff. This camera is a content creation beast. So here's a video about all the essential camera gear you need for your content creation. Check that out. Don't forget to like if you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe because you know I'd love to have you and I will see you next week.